Well, hello everyone. This is Bug Eater 64 back with you for another Allied Air Carrier flight. Today we're going from San Francisco International to Dallas Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, the weather today is going to be a little bit iffy. Uh, they're talking. We got cloud cover from about uh, six, seven thousand feet all the way up to the tops of those boomers of about uh, 20, 25,000 feet. So I'm not sure what all is going to be available to see, but uh, we're going to take our Mitsubishi MU-2 uh, for this flight. And uh, as you can see, the people at San Francisco International were so kind as to give us uh, arrows on the tarmac to show us just how to get to our runway. Won't be long now, and uh, we'll be in the air having a good time. Maybe. And I've got my co-pilot with me, Hedy LaRue, and November nine, she's going to be four, working with four, me and taking care of my radio. Contact tower on 120.5. Contact tower on 120.5. Contact tower on 120.5. Okay, Hedy, you want to answer that, man? Tower, November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra. November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra, runway, 1, left, clear for takeoff. All right, we got our clearances. Just happened to be here runway at the runway, one ready left. to go. Clear for and thank you, Hedy. November, Heddy. Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra. Left trim here, ailerons. Like our uh, trim's good for takeoff. Let's get her on the way. Brakes off, and we're rolling. Let's give it a little more rudder here. Try to keep it on the center runway. There is so much torque in this little airplane. And we're off. November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra, contact center on 132.2. Contact center on 132.2, November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra. November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra, Kilo, Sierra, Foxtrot, Oscar, altimeter, 2, Niner, Niner, 2. Kilo, Sierra, Foxtrot, Oscar, altimeter, 2, Niner, Niner, 2. November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra. November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra, are you with me? November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra, Squawk 4, 7, 0, 1. Squawk 4, 7, 0, 1, November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra. November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra, Squawk 4, 7, 0, 1. I thought we did. November, Niner, 4, 4, X-ray, Sierra. Are you with me? Of course we're with you. Have been since the beginning. We're 
just flying along with a little jazz. Oh yeah. Passengers are alive and well. Welcome back. You can hear them. Outstanding. One of my best mates at school. He it's always a good time. He was dad uh, was in the army. Uh, ended up doing something. And his uh, wife got pregnant. Did realise at the time when she found out Qantas uh, would not let her fly. So he was born. Yeah, she was born. Uh, he was born for Christmas. Australia. That's where we went. Each, yeah, yeah, we got, actually I'd got up the clouds here for a while. Uh, aged 18, brought myself a place with all my earnings as a kid and working for me dad. 1,100 feet, cruising yeah, nicely. I'd, he just passed, I'd passed 18 in October. I think he passed 18 following Can't January. Can't see anything through the clouds though. So. And not long after, without a word to me or anyone, he'd gone. And I bumped into his dad about six weeks so later. So we'll get back to you when we uh, get closer to our destination. We're socked in now. Nothing but white. I says, no, I says, uh, not going to be a lot to see. Nothing. And he says, you know he's in Australia, don't you? I says, I don't know. He didn't even. All right. Back with you now. As you can see, it's it's dark out. We're losing some altitude here. Try to we're past the mountains, and we're going to see if we can uh, get underneath these clouds. Yeah, we didn't know. <laughs> some blue and red lights down there. Looks like law enforcement is going somewhere. Hope they're not looking for us. Maybe they'll meet us at the airport. I hope not. They're in hot pursuit. Yeah, but of what? They'll never catch us. They'll never take us alive. It'd be dark out here tonight. At this point, we're flying over Abilene, Texas, just on the outskirts.
Yeah, it looks like we've made it into around the outskirts of Dallas. Staying underneath the clouds here. Looks like we're going to have a pretty night to land. We'll be able to stay underneath the clouds. Yes, please. Blonde and sweet. Co-pilot's just offered me a fine cup of hot joe, and she takes really good care of me. I like flying at night, all those city lights. Big interstate down there. I think it's I-20. All the peoples in the vehicles. I prefer it up here. Big one, Dallas Fort Worth. Very busy international airport. Just a pretty, pretty night. Can't see any stars because of the cloud cover, but at this altitude, sure can see the lights.
we can start getting the airplane slowed down and get her prepped for landing. See if I can do this one-handed so I don't have to set down my coffee. I don't want to spill it. So I'm going to let the co-pilot handle my throttles and flaps settings, and uh, I'll just control the yoke and enjoy my hot joe. The way I've been flying lately, I'll probably land better with one hand. I do with using two. Passengers appreciate that. base. And then we'll do a fairly short final. She's slowing down nicely. Here we go. The base. Turning to final. Touch down between about 110, 117, 118 knots. Everything's looking good. Oh, yeah. oh that's good. Good coffee. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, we're sitting. That's it. Give me 20, 20 degrees of flap. Thank you, Hetty. We're doing fine. Throttles are down. Doing good airspeed. Too bad, especially when you got a good co pilot. the 
the threshold. We ease her down now. down. Nice, smooth touchdown. Alright. Get her slowed down here. Pull off the runway. Okay. Clean up the aircraft, put the flaps up. Pull off onto the taxiway. And another good flight. Thanks for coming. We'll see you all next time.